Hi, it's July 2, 2010, and I'm making a video about learning the third movement of the Pathetique Sonata by Beethoven. I used to know this pretty well, and so I'm actually relearning it because I sort of forgot it. And there's a couple of comments I just wanted to make. One is that this is a particularly good piece for breaking into little parts because it doesn't so it doesn't really require any super technique, like really super fast scales or anything, except for just a very couple of very short ones that you can really work on. Another thing, I like to work on memorizing things from the end and work backwards for a couple of reasons. One, I'm always working towards something I know better, which I like. I'm not tempted to stop and uh, not get to the part that I need to work on. And then... Uh, well, there's a couple other reasons, but I usually do like to memorize from the back. And so on the path of teak, that means that I start at the back. I spent, I don't know how many minutes I spent just trying to go. And then the the scale, of course, the thing to do there is to just break it down into little pieces. Like this version. And maybe, maybe play a little bit of it backwards and forwards. And then play it quietly. And maybe a few more, add a few more notes. Oh, yeah. 
yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then bam. So it's actually the eighth note is the Thank you. 